Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today's Wednesday, so it's what you're working on Wednesday. Uh, it's been a busy day today. It's already like 6 o'clock in the evening. <laughs> but this morning, oh, I slept in because <laughs> Devin was off work and I take advantage of those days to sleep in. But uh, when I got up, we had to run to get Jesse's tablet. It got fixed. Um, we weren't able to drop it off until Monday because over the weekend was a really rough weekend with <laughs> the baby, which I mentioned in my last video. But um, so we dropped it off Monday um afternoon it was evening now it was like around three um and then they called us <clears throat> this morning and or they called me last night and said that it was done but it was like 20 minutes before they closed and we live about 25 minutes from where they're at so um uh, that's why we went and got it this morning but we did and got it fixed and uh we also i bought a um screen protector for it uh i know that it's not going to protect it from like breaking again but it'll protect it a little bit and it'll keep it safe from scratches and stuff but anyway so he has his tablet <laughs> we also took him to my um my mom's he wanted to go to her house and while we were in that town i picked up my glasses because they were done too so this is one pair of them i got gold ones <laughs> let's see there you go <laughs> trying to get that light ring not in it i like them <laughs> and then also got a black pair a black tortoise shell pair i think i took pictures if i if i did i'll put it in here <laughs> but anyways I just wanted to fill you guys in on that, let you know that he's getting his tablet fixed. I wish I took a before picture so I could show you how bad it was. Um, but it was pretty bad. Like from the bottom corner up, it was spider webbed. And then up on the top corner, it was just broken like all the bits. It didn't spider web, but it was like little chunks was just falling off. It was bad. But I'm glad they were able to fix it and there's nothing wrong with it. And now with the new screen and the protection on there, it looks like it has better quality like 40 or so, or 4k whatever it's called it looks like so much um clearer but i guess it's because the screen was so bad i don't know but it's fixed and i also got a quote on to fix his uh switch so i'm probably gonna do that after my next bag update is to get his switch screen fixed because it's got cracks in it too <laughs> but um i'm just glad we got his tablet fixed yeah now he's he's got it with him and his grandma's <laughs> but uh anyways so this wednesday uh i haven't crocheted anything at all today but I'm going to work on this later today. So that still counts. <laughs> so I finished one of my whips. Um, it's a Stitcher library. So I'll be sharing that with you guys in a few days. Whenever I can get around to recording it. It's an amigurumi that I've been working on forever. But I finally got it done. So I decided to pick up this blanket of Jessie's. Because I want to hurry and get it done. To you know get it off my whip list. And this is it so far. It's beveled really bad. But I don't think he'll care at all. So um, it's just the same it's technically a rug pattern <laughs> that i was making for underneath june's jumper um <clears throat> bouncer um i think it's called cushy rug i can't remember who it's by but i'll link it below it's basically just a round blanket um pattern and i, I have i do use it underneath her bouncer and uh i've laid her on it a few times but we, we actually got a rug for the living room for her to roll around on <laughs> but um so here's his so far. This yarn is called Burnett Baby Blanket Stripes. Colorway is Tiny Teal. And I believe it's 100% acrylic. 100% polyester. It's a number six, super bulky. And this is the first cake of it to have about half the cake left still. And I'm using an <clears throat> uh, in hook, which is a nine millimeter. Uh, so. I'm gonna use up the whole first cake and I got a second cake and hopefully that'll come out a pretty good size um if not I'll look up and try to find some more like another cake or two of this yarn but uh, I'm gonna use all this up first before I decide on whether I'm gonna do that or not because yeah I'm only making this for him because he acted like he wanted one after I made June's so uh we'll see if he actually uses it or not but um this is the only yarn I had on hand that was thick like that and I just got this recently from i believe lisa from happy hook um creations crochet i can't remember <laughs> but she sent me a gift with a uh, baby gift and she sent some yarn in it and i believe this was two cakes that was in there but it's looking pretty good i like it and burnout blankets always really soft so i'm gonna work on that tonight we just got done we ate some pizza i got one of the pizzas from stranger things today when we were at walmart we had to pick up some more vitamins for jesse um so I got one of those just to try it because I love Stranger Things. And we just we just ate it for dinner. And um, we watched the new episode of Obi-Wan. Because <laughs> I've been watching that, of course. I love Star Wars. Um, 
I binge watched Stranger Things the day it came out. Oh, it took me all day though because I had the baby. <laughs> so um, I had to keep pausing it, you know, and taking time off of it. But I watched it all day that day uh, into the night, well into the night. <laughs> and I'm looking so forward for July 1st to get here so I can see the last two episodes of season four. What else did we watch? Oh, we watched Flubber, <laughs> the movie Flubber. The one, the newer one, the one with uh, Robin Williams in it that came out in the 90s sometime. Or the early 2000s. I can't remember. But yeah, so we're just chilling. June's in there asleep right now, and Devin's in there with her. Jesse, like I said, is at my mom's. Uh, he wanted, he has to go there this morning, so we took him. And yeah, I guess that's it. Not, didn't do anything good for, you know, fancy for dinner. Just got a pizza. We don't usually buy frozen pizzas that much anymore because they're so expensive. And even this one was really expensive. It was like almost $7. But I only bought it because it was Stranger Things. It's a lot cheaper to make your own pizza at home, which is what we usually do now. Because um, frozen pizzas are so expensive. It's crazy. But yeah, so I'm glad I got my new glasses. I like the shape of these ones. They're really big, so it helps me to see without having frames in my view <laughs> but and I like the gold I just think it's cool but um my prescription only changed a little smidge so I was a little I feel like a little cross-eyed earlier I feel like my eyes were like really wide open and like my pupils were dilated but I'm pretty used to them now I don't feel like I'm having a hard time focusing now <laughs> but um so I got two new pairs of glasses I'll keep my old pair for emergency glasses so now I have three pairs of emergency glasses which I think is too many <laughs> but um I'm going to hold on to them because you never know. Uh, I'll eventually donate them. I know there's a lot of charities that take uh, prescription glasses because they uh, can, you know, find people with similar prescriptions and give them to them. So I need to do that with, I guess, three pairs of emergency glasses. It's too many. <laughs> but uh, we'll see. But, yeah, so I don't think I have anything else really to blab about. I took a few clips, I think, earlier because I had intended to vlog. And as per usual... I did not finish it. So if I did, if they're worth looking at, <laughs> I will pop them in. I'll pop in the pictures of my other pair of glasses um, and the pizza box. <laughs> I took a picture of it. Uh, I can't think if I took a picture of anything else. I don't know. You'll see it if you see it, I guess. So I will see you guys maybe tomorrow because I want to do that Never Have I Ever tag. And I want to do the I Got a Stitcher Library. I gotta work on, I'm gonna be doing, I'm participating in a collaboration with Kim, the Crafty Nomad, is hosting, she already hosted a springtime channel hop, and now it's gonna be a summertime channel hop, <laughs> um, so I'm participating in that, and I gotta get my video recorded and ready to go up for that, I got a lot of stuff I need to do, I started sewing today, it's going to be some larger tote bags and notion pouches, and some of the tote bags are going to have matching notion pouches with them. So, yeah, I just got a weather alert. Doesn't say what it is, but it's for my area. I better check that. <laughs> um, it's been storming a lot on and off the last few days. Here, and I saw that Alabama was getting pretty rough right now. The northern part. But, yeah, so I'm going to try to get this blanket done soon. Um, most of it is I hate working with this big hook. It hurts my hands. And I want to focus on my sweater because I found... Like four more sweaters that I really want to make really bad. <laughs> and um, I also found a blanket that I got to make. I got to buy its pattern. It's only $5, so I'll buy it next time I have a random $5 on my PayPal from like um, survey websites and stuff. Or Knit Crate sends me some funds or something, whatever. Whichever happens first. I want to buy it off of uh, Etsy. I'll pop it up. But it's the carpet pattern from The Shining, which is one of my most favorite movies. And it's a blanket though, so I, won't, I definitely want to make that. And I can use red heart colors for it. It calls for cherry red coffee. I think it's the darker brown than coffee. It might be. No, because cafe latte is the light brown. So it's probably it's cherry red coffee and pumpkin. I can't remember now. But it's orange, brown, and red. So I'm excited about that. I really want to make that. <laughs> but, uh. Yeah, anyways, I'm going to hop off here and get this edited for you guys and start later in the day. And I will see you guys in another video soon. And I'll announce when the bags are done for a shop update. It'll probably be maybe Saturday or Sunday but, or Monday. I don't know. It'll happen whenever I share, I guess. It's going to be, did I already say? It's eight tote bags. And I think there's seven Notion pouches, but some of them go with the tote bags. 
some of the tote bags don't i didn't have enough fabric to make matching ones so it's just gonna be random <laughs> you'll see i guess when, when i show them but i'm gonna hop off here and i'll see you guys in the video bye guys oh wait i forgot to say let me know what you're working on down below i always i forget that sometimes uh for, for feel free to share any links and things and uh, let me know what you have for dinner because I like to know. And if you have any cool recipes, share them below too so I can check them out. Now, I will see you guys in another video. Bye, guys.